everybody, it's Matt from You and Your Horror Movies, and welcome to my final shelf of my uh, shelf to shelf video. This is shelf 18. Wow, guys. We did it. All these shelves to the top is now done. So, this was shelf of my horror DVD Blu rays. Also, thank you again for watching uh, my videos and liking and subscribing and commenting. It means a lot. So without further ado, let's get on to the last shelf. All right, up top here we have uh, Willy's Wonderland. I love Willy's Wonderland. Um, I know it gets a lot of hate, but I definitely enjoy it. Uh, Venom. It's like a weird killer snake movie. This woman runs over a snake and it follows her another bunch of snakes along with like robbers and shit it's weird up here we have is the widow it's a cool like russian found footage uh creature feature type movie i liked it all right so up down here we have oops i'm falling uh venomous with treat williams fun uh killer snake movie so i'm gonna see if i can do this without knocking more stuff over uh, Verotica, this is, uh, the dude, what's his face? It's an anthology done by, uh, Glenn Danzing. A lot of people don't like it. I thought it was okay. I liked it. I was like, I need a vacuum down there. Uh, Versus. Versus is an awesome zombie martial arts movie. Uh, VFW. I really enjoyed VFW for what it was. Uh, you know, a bunch of old vets going against these um, punk-like people. Uh, Tom Savini's uh, Vicious. When I still have to get around watching. It's like a weird type of creature feature. Uh, the original Village of the Damned. Classic. Uh, the Vineyard. Oh, 80s cheese right there. Uh, Vi, it's a foreign film. Uh, it's really cool, really weird and twisted how that movie plays out. Uh, the Violence Movie, this is a low budget. I shot on video like made in the backyard of people, but I thought it was pretty cool. I like the artwork how they did on that. It looks like old school. Uh, Virgin Among the Living Dead, another redemption reline. Wow, I'll try to do this with two hands here. Uh, Voices from Beyond, Fulci, fun. Uh, low budget, The vor Vortex, like a weird mutant giant snake and scorpion movies and people getting turned into them and it's really weird. Yeah, let me hold it this way. Uh, Walled In, it's another one I need to get around checking because it's like a serial killer is walling people into the buildings. War of the Worlds, classic War of the Worlds. Uh, Warning Sign. That's an awesome movie. Uh, this is The Wasp Woman. This is the Jim Wynorski remake from the 90s. It's got all practical effects. Except for like a weird morphing scene, but I like it. So yeah, The Wasp Woman. And yeah, the original Wasp Woman with Beast from the Haunted Cave. Uh, Watchers and Watchers 2. Awesome double feature, creature feature. Uh, Watchers 3, it's kind of like a Predator ripoff, still good. And then Watchers 4, Reborn, with uh, Mark Hamill. This was like a made-for-sci-fi TV movie. Still done with the way of the movies. Uh, Web of the Spider. Webs, sci-fi channel movie. Uh, Wendigo, it's a pretty cool flick. Uh, were this is kind of like a reversed werewolf movie. Uh, Weird Fiction was an okay anthology put out by uh, Wild Eye Releasing. Werewolf in a, in a woman's prison. <laughs> this is gory, interesting, fun. You can see like there's the werewolf right there. How gory that shit is. So if you like women in prison movies and werewolf movies, you'll dig it. Uh, Werewolf on Wheels. That's fun. Up top here we have is uh, the Wrong Turn. Uh, different type of Wrong Turn movie. 
uh, What Lies Beneath with Harrison Ford and Michelle Pfeiffer. Um, I liked it. Pretty cool, like, thriller type movie. Uh, a Whisper in the Dark. Uh, Whisper in the Darkness. This is based on H.P. Lovecraft. White Dog. This is a cool, uh, like a racist dog kills uh, people. Alright, switch hands. Uh, we have Classic White Zombie. Uh, Who Done It? Vinegar Syndrome Slasher. We have uh, Who Could Kill a Child, put up by Mondo Macabro. So you got that cool uh, killer kid flick. Uh, the Wicker Man, this is the remake. It was okay. Uh, my wife actually likes this more than the original, which is shocking, but that is what it is. Uh, the Wig, very slow burn Asian flick. Uh, Willard. Classic Willard. Ah! And the remake of Willard with Crispin Glover. I like the remake. That was pretty cool. Uh, the Wind. It's a weird type of slasher from Arrow. Alright, I gotta switch hands and move a little bit. So hopefully I don't do this without knocking stuff over. Because I'm in a tight spot. Too late. Okay. Uh, Witch, Wishcraft. Uh, it's a weird slasher where a guy gets uh, makes a wish from a monkey's paw and someone's killing people off. Uh, the Witch's Mirror. This is a Spanish horror film. Pretty cool uh, flick. Uh, Witch Tales. Uh, low budget anthology. It was okay. Uh, Witch Board. Awesome. <laughs> and you have uh, Witchboard 2, which is fun. And I get this one out. Uh, Witchboard 3, which is not, it's okay, but not the greatest. Up on top is What the Waters Left Behind. Kind of like a Texas Chainsaw Massacre ripoff. All right. Whoa. Let me see here. Let me set this down on this tripod to get this rest of this wall here and move when I need to move because yeah, I need to make room okay sorry about that uh, which board this is an Asian version of uh, which board something a little different witchcraft <laughs> I, this is the only one I own from those weird witchcraft movies. Uh, Wither. This is like an Evil Dead ripoff. Pretty good. Uh, the WNUF Halloween special. This is awesome. It's like all fake uh, movie special that's an actual real movie. And it's got like fake commercials and everything. Really cool flick. Uh, Wolfen. This is not a werewolf film, but it's more like a killer wolves. But they talk about shape shifting and everything. Wolf Creek. Oh, I love Wolf Creek. And then you have Wolf Creek 2. Heard a rumor they're making a third one. Uh, the Wolfman. This is the Del Toro, which I really enjoyed. I saw this in the theater. Uh, the Woods. This is a cool, like, witchcraft movie. You deal with nature and everything. Even Bruce Campbell has a uh, cameo in it. Uh, the Wood Chipper Massacre. <laughs> yeah, shot on video. People killing their grandma with a giant wood chipper. Yeah, fun flick. Uh, the woman. Ah, yep. So I'm in a tight squeeze here. 
Uh, the Woman Eater. This is a killer plant movie. Low budget DVD right there. <clears throat> the Woman in Black, which I thought was pretty good. Daniel Radcliffe. And then the sequel, Woman in Black Part 2. Uh, Wonton Baby. <laughs> yeah. Killer Mutant Baby, pretty much. <clears throat> we got Worm. Ah, really weird, trippy, dreamlike movie. Uh, would you rather people at a betting table say, like, would you rather do this? Would you rather do that? It leads to pretty gruesome stuff. Uh, the Wrath of Crows. Not a killer crow movie. I wish it was, but it's, it's kind of weird how this movie is. Uh, Russell Massacre. This is the uh, independent version I got. It's, uh, signed and everything. Pretty much about a wrestler who goes nuts. Then we have another movie called Russell Maniac with uh, the original Rey Mysterio. They're shooting a porno and of course in a town. And there's a killer wrestler going around killing people. Okay. So I'm gonna move this over here. We have Xenophobia. Cool creature feature, a lot of practical effects. Sorry if there's any glare. Extro with Extro Part 2 on it. Double feature, awesome alien flicks. Then the, seek, the third one, Extro 3. Uh, watch out for the skies, put up by Vinegar Syndrome. Uh, Yeti, Sci-Fi Channel, Killer Yeti movie, which is actually pretty good. Right, I might move the camera a little bit more that way. That's the way it's setting. Uh, the Young Cannibals. Creature feature about a people eat burgers made out of meat and the cannibal monster goes after them. It's actually really good. You can't kill Stephen King. Uh, horror comedy. Uh, the Zero Boys. This was actually pretty cool. From Arrow. So we're in the Z's. All right. uh, zombies with Tony Todd. Uh, this actually wasn't bad. I found this at a dollar store. And it's actually not bad for a flick. Uh, Zombie A-Hole. Dustin Mills flick. Let's go with the title right there. Uh, Zombie Island Massacre. <laughs> but a bunch of people going to a Zion retreat. And the locals are killing them off because one of them is not who they say they are. Okay. Uh, Zombie Lake <laughs> is a pretty bad redemption movie, but the movie is actually entertaining. You know what? I'm going to take this out. Make this a little bit easier. Uh, zombies, the beginning, Fulch, uh, Bruno Matai's like, ripoff of Aliens. Uh, Zombie Diaries Part 2, which I never had the first one. Uh, Zombie Night, which actually wasn't bad. I think I got that at a dollar store. Zombie Nightmare, that's <laughs> easy with Adam West and Tia Carreri. Uh, Zombie World, awesome anthology. Again, I'm trying to do this upside down. And the last two we have is Zombies, <laughs> Killer Zombie Animals, and the sequel, Zombies Part 2. Holy crap. All right, guys, that's it. Shelf 18 is complete. Uh, let me know in the comments section down below your thoughts. And i got to probably a couple more videos to do later on. Not shelving videos. <laughs> later, guys. Peace.